Welcome to our video on SaaS. Today, we're tackling an intriguing question from one of our viewers. They want to know if it's possible to use a ternary condition in SAS, specifically when working with class objects. Imagine a scenario where you want to dynamically set a CSS property based on a class condition. Our viewer provided an example that looks like this. A class selector for font awesome icons where the top position changes based on whether the class contains left. Let's dive into this question and explore how we can achieve this in SAS. Welcome back to another technical video. Today, we'll be going through your questions, answering them, and hopefully finding that solution you need. Guys, remember to stay just a little bit crazy, just like me, and hopefully you'll find that solution you're looking for. Now, let's continue on to the video. In SAS, we can use conditional logic to apply styles based on certain conditions. However, SAS does not support ternary conditions directly on class selectors, like in your example. Instead, we can achieve similar functionality using mixins or functions. Let's create a mixin that takes a condition and applies styles accordingly. In this example, we define a mixin called position that takes a Boolean parameter. The if function checks the condition and sets the top property based on whether it's true or false. Now, you can use this mixin in your class definitions. Just call the mixin with the desired condition to apply the appropriate styles. In summary, while you can't use a ternary condition directly in class selectors in SAS, you can effectively use mixins and the if function to achieve similar results. Let's now look at a user-suggested answer. Yes, you can use a ternary condition in SAS. If you set the variable caret top, it will use that value. If not, it defaults to top 45. Let's now look at another user-suggested answer. In SAS, you don't need to match by class attribute selector. Instead, you can use a loop with interpolation to create your classes. This method compiles to specific classes with their respective top offsets, like fa caret left and fa caret right. Let's now look at another user-suggested answer. In SAS, when using a ternary condition, you need to skip quotes and avoid empty values. For an empty string, use parentheses instead. Here's a custom font mixin that demonstrates these principles. It retrieves font sizes from a map and applies a conditional important flag. Let's now look at another user-suggested answer. You can use a variable for a ternary condition in SAS. For example, set a position variable 
and use it to determine the top value based on its state. And that's it guys. We've gone through, answered your question I hope, and you found that resolution. Guys, if this helped, please hit subscribe. I'd really appreciate it. And until next time, have a good one.